latest in that debate over a proposed gay marriage ban in Indiana. Now, Advance America says Indiana school children would be taught that gay marriage and homosexuality is normal if the state doesn't pass a constitutional amendment to ban same-sex marriage. Opponents say that is nonsense, but the rhetoric is being ratcheted up. Our Derek Thomas joins us now with that story. Derek. Todd, the goal of this latest volley from Advance America is to get voters to call their legislators and tell them to vote for HDR6. Advance America is making this flyer available to churches for their Sunday bulletins. It lists four dangers of same-sex marriage. One of the dangers, if homosexual marriages are legalized in the state of Indiana, would be that all children in the public schools would be taught that homosexual marriages and homosexuality is normal and acceptable. It's part of the homosexual agenda. This is factually inaccurate. Family law professor Jennifer Drobak says the goal of the flyer and Advance America is not to inform but to promote pan Panic and misinformed panic. This flyer is designed to demonize and make same-sex couples less than and less worthy than other couples and it's it's designed to put fear into the hearts and minds of other Hoosiers so that they will then vote against the civil rights for these same-sex couples and their families. Those opposed to the ban on same-sex marriage continued to mount their campaign against HJR 6 with yard signs. And earlier this week, Mary Cheney, the daughter of former Vice President Dick Cheney, was a featured speaker at an event to raise money for the fight. But Miller and his base is not going away. It's time for the legislature to pass it in 2014 so that people have the opportunity to protect marriage between a man and a woman. It's the right thing to do. Citizens in over 30 states have had that opportunity. Indiana citizens deserve that too. Now Miller would not say how many churches put the flyer in their bulletins, but there will be many more mailers and messages before this volatile issue is resolved. Derek Thomas, RTV6.